Hi, and welcome to the Shape Your Future Healthy Kitchen, sponsored by TSET. I'm Heidi. I am here with Chef Val from OUT School of Community Medicine. Always learn so much from you. Thank you. So what are you teaching me today? I'm going to teach you how to add a little nutrition to your standard uh, mashed potatoes that you okay. might be having this time of year. Right. Okay. Probably having some of those. So your favorite mashed potato recipe, use that as your base, but maybe kind of lighten it up. Um, these are just made with olive oil and salt. Okay. okay. And so I actually do like the gold flesh potato, yellow flesh potato. These are Yukon gold, but sometimes they are sold under yellow flesh potato. Okay. And I think they actually, maybe it's just what I think because they're yellower, but they do have a betterier flavor. And so these don't have any any better in them. Okay. Okay. So it's good to know, but it, it kind of gives you the look that it is. Right. Right. Exactly. And so um, then this is butternut squash. I forgot to bring one to show, but so it's a butternut squash. And you can see that I have taken the flesh mm -hmm. of one of those and I'm, I'll scrape one out just so that okay. you can see. And so this just comes out really easily. Just cut it in half be um, before you cook it. Cut it in half. Scrape out the seeds. Uh -huh. Roast it. it. Oops, sorry. Go ahead. That's so okay. Roast it for, um, it'd probably take an hour or so. Well, that was my question, so you just answered it. Okay. <laughs> and this is, again, just great ways to put in some of those healthier options into maybe some of your family favorites. Right. And just getting those little touches of healthier options. Yeah. So this is just going to get mashed. Now, if I'm doing this for a larger crowd, mm -hmm. I probably would use a mixer to get it nice and blended up. But really, okay. this is fine because it's super, super soft. And what happens whenever you roast things, you're actually intensifying the flavor because you're removing the water. Oh, interesting. See, yep. I tell you, I'm learning everything all the time from you. So that's a great tip as well, just that you're getting more of those nutrients too because you're releasing some of that water from there. Yes. And so we want to be able to see both the potatoes and the squash. So just really gently. Okay fold this together. You don't have to make it, um, whoops, you don't have to make it all homogenized. And so when you get it to about this point, then you can kind of ah, put it on your... Hence the marble effect. Marble, <laughs> yes. Oh my goodness, they look so great. Yeah, and you're right, just by doing a little bit of that fold in, like perfectly imperfect right. in its own way, and you're getting a healthier option as well. Right. Perfect. So this is a great side dish. I'm going to taste it because I have to. That's what I do. So we love to take something that's ordinary and interject some vegetables in it. A little more fiber. Oh yeah, they're really good, huh? They're delicious. Yeah, and good, this is a you. great side dish, especially with all your holiday parties and mm -hmm. events and things. Right. Perfect. Thank you. Thank you. If you want to learn more about this recipe or any of the other recipes, go ahead and head to KJRH.com.